Hello, I'm Ong Tzu. I'm the Product Line Director for Power Conversion America at Fairchild Semiconductor. Today, we will review the applications and the technology behind the FAN 9612 Interleave Dual Boundary Conduction Mode Power Factor Correction Controller. The FAN 9612 provides important features for maximizing efficiency up to 96%, even at low line, with the best-in-class protection for the PFC power converters. The FAN 9612 can be used in 100 to 1,000 watt offline AC to DC power supplies. Typical application segments include low profile, high efficiency AC to DC adapters, computing power for servers and PCs, display power for LCD and PDP TVs, as well as power supplies for fixed communication, white goods like air conditioners, and many industrial applications. First, a quick background. What is boundary conduction mode, or BCM, operation in a PFC? BCM is a simple to design, well understood variable frequency control technique where the PFC MOSFET turns on at zero current and minimum voltage, reducing switching losses. It is also known as critical conduction mode or transition mode. One of its main benefits is to provide higher efficiency than the continuous conduction mode or CCM converters, shown here on the right. The trade-off is the high peak ripple currents affecting input and EMI filter designs. For this reason, the BCM PFC converters are traditionally limited to around 300 watts of output power. Interleaving extends the benefits of BCM to a higher power level. Interleaving is just a special case of paralleling converters, so for two parallel converters, each is running 180 degrees out of phase from each other. At the heart of the FAN 9612 is the proprietary sync clock technology, which provides accurate interleaving in all operating conditions. One, it is accurate, keeps the two phases perfectly at 180 degrees out of phase. Two, it is fast, it responds to change of frequency in one switching cycle. And three, it is robust, which means it works over all operating conditions, including transient conditions. Let's look at some of the benefits of interleaving and what sync clock technology provides. First, paralleling itself brings benefits of lower power level designs for each stage, modularity, lower component stresses, and easier thermal management. But there are additional benefits from interleaving as well. Here we have a 400 watt universal PFC converter using the FAN 9612. We will be looking at the inductor currents of each channel. The scope picture has the current waveforms of each inductor for two line cycles at the top. The total inductor current, shown at the bottom, has much less peak-to-peak -peak current due to interleaving. You can see that from the perfect synchronization, there are no spurious pulses in the combined waveform. In a more detailed time scale, you can see that the currents are out of phase by 180 degrees and how that results in a smaller peak-to-peak -peak total current. So, interleaving brings benefits of EMI reduction due to lower peak currents, higher effective frequency from component size reduction, and longer component lifetime from lower stresses. Running two phases also means one of them can be shut off, also referred to as phase shed or phase drop, to increase efficiency and light load conditions. This is commonly known as phase management. Let's take a look. When the load decreases, the FAN 9612 automatically disables one of the two interleave boost converters. This happens when the output power level falls below approximately 12%, which is the default threshold. Normal interleave operation of the two converters resumes when the output power level exceeds approximately 19%. These thresholds can be modified upwards by changing the maximum on time. Here we have the phase management waveforms. First, you can see that the gate drives of the two channels on the top are properly interleaved. When the light load threshold is reached, channel 2 is immediately disabled and the current in channel 1 picks up the full load. The second waveform here shows a phase adding operation. Looking at a much larger time scale over several line cycles, we see that there are minimal changes in the line current waveforms during phase dropping or adding operations. This is due to the advanced phase management technique of FAN 9612. Now let's look at some other technologies of FAN 9612 that provide important protection functions. Line feedforward is the function that is possible because of FAN 9612's advanced line sensing method. It uses the input voltage information to modulate the output voltage. There are three key benefits of input voltage feedforward. One, it minimizes output voltage variation against the line voltage variations. Two, it provides a constant power limit. And three, it provides easy feedback loop design. Here we see that when the line input is changing, even from 110 volt AC line to 220 volt AC, there is little to no variation in the output voltage. Now let's look at the closed loop soft drive technology. In a conventional PFC converter, there is always an output voltage overshoot due to the slow PFC voltage loop. 
However, in the proprietary intelligent closed loop soft start of fan 9612, the reference voltage of the air amplifiers increase adaptively to prevent air amplifier from saturation. This method effectively minimizes upper voltage overshoot as can be seen here. Now let's summarize the 9612 technology and features that help with efficiency. In addition to the benefits of interleaved BCM operation and the phase management function for light load efficiency, the FAN 9612 includes key technologies to further improve efficiency. Its valley switching technology does not use any RC delay circuit for the zero current detection and accurately senses the value of the switching waveform to minimize the COSS losses at the turn on of the MOSFET. It also has strong integrated gate drivers to reduce switching losses, low current sense thresholds for low conduction losses, low startup and operating currents, and a maximum switching frequency clamp. The efficiency of the 400 watt demo boat is shown here. At high line or at 230 volt AC input, the efficiency is around 98%. This number includes cable loss as well as losses in the EMI filter. As power level decreases, phase management kicks in around 30% for this design to keep the efficiency up. The red line shows a drop in efficiency at light load without phase management. At 110 volt AC input, the efficiency is still over 96%, even including cable loss and losses in the EMI filter. Integrated protection functions are also an important benefit that the FAN 9612 provides. In addition to the closed loop soft start and line fee forward, the FAN 9612 also provides comprehensive functions for best converter protection. The controller integrates key features such as input brownout protection, line over voltage protection, dual or double OVP, one non-latching and one latching, independent current limit and power limit for each channel, and constant power limit over line input voltage. To recap, the FAN 9612 provides important features for maximizing efficiency up to 96%, even at low line, with the best-in-class protection for the PFC power converters. We have briefly reviewed the technology behind the FAN 9612 interleave PFC controller. More information on the FAN 9612 can be found on the Fairchild website. I am Ong Tu, a Fairchild Semiconductor. Thank you for your time.